Welcome to our CSS Deep Dive. Today, we're tackling a puzzling question that many developers encounter. Our viewer wonders, what's the deal with vertical aligned baseline? They thought they had a solid grasp on CSS, but when it came to explaining this specific behavior, they found themselves stumped. So let's break it down together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today I'll be going through your questions, answering them and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy just like me and hopefully get to that resolution you need. Now, let's get started. Let's dive into the CSS property vertical align, specifically the baseline value. The baseline alignment is used to align inline elements based on the baseline of the text. When you have multiple inline elements with different vertical align values, such as baseline and bottom, the baseline alignment can be ignored. This is because the bottom alignment takes precedence. For example, in this code snippet, the first span is set to baseline, while the second span is set to bottom. The first span's alignment is overridden by the second span's bottom alignment. However, if all spans are set to the same alignment, like baseline or any other value, they will behave as expected. This is crucial for consistent layout. This behavior isn't always well documented, but understanding how different alignments interact can help you troubleshoot layout issues in your CSS. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Let's talk about vertical align baseline. It starts with understanding the baseline of the parent element. When you set a span's vertical alignment to baseline, it aligns the bottom of the text, like the letter N. This makes it easy to see how other spans align in relation to it. In the example, span one has a border to highlight its edges. Other spans are aligned differently, one at the top, another in the middle, and one at the bottom, showcasing how vertical alignment affects their positioning. And that's it, guys. We've gone through, answered your question, and hopefully you found that solution you're looking for. Guys, if you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, you need technical help, I'll see ya. Have a good one.